guys hi hi you're welcome back to jerry's kitchen and lifestyle and to you the new subscribers the new viewers karibuni sana you're very much welcome to jerry's kitchen yes <laughs> i know you guys are wondering is this jerry's kitchen really yes it is in jerry's kitchen yeah <laughs> a kenyan kitchen yeah so today i'm vlogging when in nairobi kenya i'm feeling so good although i pardon pardon me please uh i don't know what happened yeah i don't have a flu i don't have a cough um i'm not sick but it's kind of my voice i don't know i don't know yeah but i'm trying to take ginger lemon garlic yeah tea to see if i'll get my normal voice again but anyway guys that voice will not stop us from vlogging in nairobi <laughs> hey my first vlog in kenya nairobi's kitchen <laughs> anyway guys thank you so much for coming i'm so much excited and so guys, I want to tell you that I was in Kamukonji. You guy, my guy, you know, there are so many YouTubers that I do follow. I'll not mention them here because there are so many. And I see them going to Kamukonji shopping, 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 shopping. And I was like, when I come in Kenya, I have to take myself to Kamukonji and shop these goody goodies I see people shopping, yeah? And so... I did it and I was at Kamukonji and I want to show you what I shopped. Yes. So let me start with this one. I really wanted this set. This kitchen set was like, this is a dream come true. Yeah. It has everything inside. And I was like, people are shopping this stuff and I love it. Yeah. And let me tell you something else. It's about the price. You know, uh, when you go somewhere and you you don't have the approximately price of the thing you can just it can just shoot and you think yeah it's just good price so i saw a youtuber vlogging and she said that she had bought this for 2000 and i was like okay 2000 kenyan shillings i saw another one who said she got it for 1800 okay yes so when i got went to kamkunji i never knew that the colors also depend <laughs> the color matters yeah so this color and the gray one was costing 2200 but i said no i have 2000 and they were like no the other colors they are 2000 you can get them with 18 but for this one is 2200 and i was like okay i want to uh, buy this one but if you will not take 2000 it's okay so the shopkeeper say okay and i went to the next one so when i went to the next one and i bargained and i got it for 2000 kenyan shillings yeah so and it was good to go yes so here i have my kitchen set yes food and drinks i love it 2000 kenyan shillings something else i wanted to get for my mama is this one when she's washing her her utensils spoons and um forks and knives she can put them here to dry yeah before she put them in the drawers yeah so i really wanted this one and i bought it for yeah they said it was 300 kenyan shillings but i got it at 250 kenyan shillings something else i wanted this let me show you first in the picture because i wanted these drawers uh straw to put in your drawer so you can enlarge it as you want to have your spoons and your kitchen tools inside here so this is the thing this is what i got yeah so you can just which side is it <laughs> yeah push it like this like that yeah yes so i got it at 700 kenyan shillings they started at 800 but we went up to 700 yeah so i got this and the next thing this one for storage i got it for my mama it costed 750 kenyan shillings 
she said so but i got it at 650 yeah so they are inside there are so many inside how many were they i don't remember let me count this is one okay let us count this one sir. this is one two three four the last one yeah the smallest so there are six buckets inside here 650 kenyan shillings yeah yes and you guy my guy i really wanted this one. i'm not sure if i'm going to leave it here or if i'm going to take it with me to norway i love eggs you guy my guy you know how jerry loves eggs yeah and i love to try so many other recipes with eggs and so I'm just in love with this. I have not yet used it yet, but I just love it. I'm going to uh, have the handle here. And so it will be like this. And I just love it. I love it. Yes. I got it at a thousand Kenyan shillings. Yeah. Yes. Muffins. Jerry does not love to bake. Jerry and baking. It's a no-go zone. But cooking other foods, that's my hobby. That's, I do it with a passion. I love to cook. But when it comes to baking, it's a, a no thank you. <laughs> so I got this to make my egg muffins, yeah? I told you guys about my eye. <laughs> I love eggs, yeah? And so I bought, um, where did I put them? All this, just look at the colors. <laughs> I fell in love with the colors too. They're so good. Yeah. You know when you're doing the egg muffins and you use this the silicones, it's kind of they they're not they're non-sticky. So it's just like you get your egg as it is. Yeah. I'm gonna make some breakfast tomorrow and we can make it and see how it is. Yeah. What I'm talking about. These ones are so good. So I'm I'm gonna be using this. I just love the colors, yeah. It's just so beautiful, yeah. So I got this for 150 Kenyan shillings. And this one I bagged. You know, I'm still a kikuyu. <laughs> so the bagain is telling me I got this one at 400 Kenyan shillings, yeah. And I love it. You guys, guys, see what I got. See what I got. <laughs> Oil dispenser. Yes oil dispensers you know how expensive oil has become so it's very nice to have like a small bottle where you can do your measurements you just get over and that's enough you know that's enough so i got this beautiful stuff at 600 kenyan shillings yeah i got two luminac yes luminac is the thing to go it's the best <laughs> this is so <laughs> yes so i got this mug at 700 kenyan shillings each and i just love them i love them yeah i love them chumbi salt to put in my salt 150 kenyan shillings you guys i tried to bargain for this stuff to get it at 100 kenyan shillings but it was a no 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 so at long last i just had to add the 50 and i bought it at 150 kenyan shillings i love it i love the color and uh, it's just beautiful it's just nice yeah here are some another lumina cups i got this at 1500 1500 kenyan shillings i love them just simple I know my mommy, if she was the one choosing, she has a lot of flowered one. I know she would choose a flowered one. But for me, I took this one. And I love it. I can't wait to try my tea here. I just love it, yeah? Yes. I love white. White is my color. I got some six balls here. Six, we are going for 800 Kenyan shillings, yeah? So I love the beauty, the flowers. I think they're so beautiful. I just love them. I got six for 800 Kenyan shillings. I got this for storage. 
you know when we have some leftover foods uh, to put in the fridge so I needed some boxes and I thought why not buy this I think I love the color and I was trying to look for something that will go even if it's not matching like something that will go in the kitchen not to have red yellow pink orange yeah whatever but anyway I got this at uh, 300 Kenyan shillings yeah? I tried to get them at 250 but the girl was like no you read, take it or leave it. So, and I said, I take it. So, I bought them. They are six at 300 Kenyan shillings. Yeah. I love the two. And I love the color. The next thing, I got these beautiful glasses. These ones. Yeah. Glasses. Just look at this. <laughs> I love the size kind of a little bit unique they're just good they're just nice and my mommy does not have like this you know she has the just the normal long glasses yeah i'm not sure that my mom will go to a shop and buy such i'm sure she just wants the old school if i can say so yeah the old school glasses but for me i think i love this just cute they're beautiful i got two pack at um 1200 kenyan shillings so one was costing 600 yeah i love it i love it and yes that was the same i got this bowl at Sinjeri's kitchen i have a lot of this in different sizes but you guy guy i was amazed of the price that they are costing here in kenya they are so expensive this one was it's a uh, luminac too but they are expensive uh than the way we buy them in norway so this one was costing 600 kenyan shillings there was a smaller one for 400 and there was a big one for 1200 kenyan shillings and that was like i thought that was expensive i don't know why but the lady tried to explain of course i know you can put it in the oven you can bake with it you can warm food in the oven but i was like is that the reason why it's so expensive I think this was expensive, yeah. So I bought this 600 Kenyan shillings. The big one was going for 800 and 1200 and the smaller, yeah. So whichever size you want. And I love it. I love it so much. You know, when you have your fruit salad or just your normal salad here, yeah, and the color is just coming out here, yeah, I just love that. And that is why I wanted this so very much. I got some board chopping board here I got this one it's a small one the big one was going for 500 Kenyan shillings chopping board but I got this for 300 and I love it it's so nice it's smooth and soft I love it and I think this one was just beautiful and I love the colors I don't know why I just love it and it was going for 350 Kenyan shillings. You can use both sides if you want. But for me, I think this side, it's just nice. I have used this side a lot, yeah. And finally, finally, no, in fact, it's not finally. I had something else, yeah. I'll show you. Look what I got. I got this set and uh, it's sugar tea and coffee I just love it you can see how it is it's like that and uh, it's a wooden stand and I just love it the bottles look at this look at these guys huh. tea sugar and coffee Kahawa, yeah? and so I just love it yeah I love it so much so this is the wood to put on it and just have it on your kitchen yes so I have something else let me find it. so guys I'm back I had forgotten this one because I had used it yeah I made some omena and ugali after church today today is on a Sunday and that is why I'm having a Sunday dress yes you can see my beautiful Sunday dress <laughs> So anyway guys, I got this one for 1200 Kenyan shillings. I like to tell how am I saying? Let me, tell, <laughs> let me tell you guys, my mommy loved this. I don't know why, but she was so happy. You know, when I got this stuff and I was looking at her face to see 
hot with like zait hammer this one she was like what i got this big fried pan so it's not i got it for 1200 kenyan shillings and they just love it i love this i love this i remember my <laughs> my niece yeah my daughter to my brother my brother yes hi my brother i love you but anyway i have to give credit where it's due it's my sister-in-law it's my sister-in-law what is she called <laughs> what is she supposed to be called the wife to my brother yeah so it's my sister-in-law that took me to come kunji and we shopped and shopped and uh, i appreciate her so much so thank you so much my twinny for coming with me and showing me come kunji and we did a good shopping so yeah i was saying about my my brother's uh, daughter yeah my small miss she was telling me that auntie you cook this is in jerry's kitchen and you know what auntie i love it that you're cooking on a pan this big pan i just see it on cartoons when i'm watching cartoons and i was like hey bro you gonna buy a pan it's just 1200 kenyan shillings and then your babies will not just be seeing the, the big pans just on the cartoons. <laughs> she was so happy that they exist in the real life. So, Auntie Wamaju, Ame Kudana, something good, yeah? So, thank you so much, guys, for watching Jerry's Kitchen. And today we were at Kamukonji shopping and everything here. This was my favorite, yeah? So, Thank you so much guys for watching. I'll be back to Kamukonji because I'm not sure that I shocked enough. So I'll see you on the next video and bye bye.